everybody and welcome back to my channel or welcome to if you are new here my name is Lily and in today's video I am going to be sharing tips on how to visualize so in the last video that I uploaded on Wednesday I did a whole vision board I will obviously link that up here if you haven't watched it yet make sure to check it out after this video but I wanted to do a whole video based around visualization because obviously a vision board is a tool that you can use to help you visualize but I genuinely love to visualize things in general so visualization med meditations is what I tend to do most there's so many forms of meditation out there there's obviously like different types of energy meditations um, you know you can do like focused meditations release meditations confidence meditations meditations all kinds of meditations genuinely it's all about just focusing on a certain thing for me personally I find when I'm trying to go for a goal visualizing is just so powerful I really get emotional about it and um, it took me a while to truly understand how to have or how to do a powerful meditation I mean a powerful visualization because I used to just kind of visualize it from almost like from a distance so it was kind of like I could see the image happening and I could like picture it but it wasn't like I was literally living and experiencing it now I know that there might be some people that are watching this video that genuinely have no idea of what I'm talking about or can't visualize when they physically see an actual like picture I like physically visualize it and see it I recently found this out to be honest because I genuinely thought that everyone could do that and then I was on a call with some of the girls and we were talking about visualization I was saying how my morning visual meditation genuinely makes me cry every day now because I've truly actually found the way to do it it was Sid that was like oh I don't when I visualize I don't visualize actual pictures she sees more colors and it's more of a feeling and mood rather than actually seeing something happen whereas I actually physically can see it um, I don't think I've got a photographic memory but it's almost like I can just imagine a situation and picture it in my head it's very weird so this may not work for everyone so if you can't really do that in your mind where you can actually like imagine something and picture it in your head then this might not necessarily work for you and I'm sorry for that but if you can this is the best way that I've found that I do visual visual meditations and just visualizing that's really powerful and worked for me what I used to do as I said is I would visualize something I'd close my eyes I'd get into that state I'd do my breathing and then I would visualize a certain situation for example there was a really powerful meditation that I did which was kind of like visualize you so you literally it's like almost like a mirror and that it's you standing in the distance but it's your future self and it's exactly like what is she wearing how is she holding herself like you can feel her like what kind of energy and um aura is she setting off to you and then walk towards her and and, and basically like absorb that energy which is really good but i've found if you're trying if you're using visualization for manifesting which is what i've been doing recently you really want to get into the feeling rather than it being like just see it like how is it how does it look how does this and now just absorb that kind of energy it's more about feeling like what it actually feels like and genuinely living in that visualization in that imagination scenario imagined scenario that you've pictured up in your head so i don't know if anyone's ever done this or if maybe i'm just absolutely fucking crazy but when i was younger and i'd have an argument with someone or something like that whenever I was in the shower or something, I would literally like re-picture the argument in my head. And But but I would like say completely different things and I'd actually say it, I'd be like, oh, yeah, well you da, 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 da. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't know if I'm the only person that does that. And if I am, that's highly embarrassing, but I'm almost certain I'm not. It's literally the same thing. Like you want to do the same thing as that, but in a positive and what you want to manifest. So for example, if you've watched the visualize, uh, the visual board video, you will know that one of my goals is to hit a thousand subscribers. I could do a manifestation visualization meditation. Wow. Where I'm picturing like, what date is it? Like, what's the day? What am I doing? Where am I? What am I wearing? What am I going to say? Am I going to do like a live video? Am I going to do a video on my story? Am I going to make a video on YouTube, like a thank you video? What am I going to say? And I don't just think what I'm going to say. I physically say it in my head. It's like I'm actually saying, the, having this conversation and I'm saying the things that I'm going to do and da, 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 in my head. And it genuinely gets me really emotional because most of the time, these are like goals that you really, really want to accomplish 
accomplish. These are goals that you really, really want to accomplish. These are things that are, you know, when people are aiming for goals, it's something that's gonna make them happy. It's something that could, you know, potentially give them financial freedom, or, you know, maybe it's like you wanna pay off debt, or you wanna do this, or you wanna do that, or whatever it is. Like, it's gonna be, it's something that you, you want to attract into your life. So, when you're in this sort of state, it's like, how is that gonna make me feel? What is this gonna do for me? Like, what am I gonna be able to do because I've accomplished this thing? Like, these are all the things that you want to have in your head, and as you're visualizing it, get into that state. You want to get into that literal environment of just like, oh my God, like I've done this. Jesus Christ, like I've just hit a thousand subscribers. Oh my God, I thought this was never gonna happen when I started, when I first ever made my YouTube video three years ago. I could only dream of hitting this milestone and now I've finally done it. Like, I've actually committed, put the work in and I'm seeing that, like, I'm seeing the results. I'm so grateful, I'm so grateful for all the people that are supporting me, that are actually getting value from the, my channel and loving the content and helping me now. Like, all of that kind of stuff. Like, what are you thinking, feeling, like what are you saying? What are you gonna do? How is it like the environment? Where are you gonna be? Are you gonna be in your room? Like be as specific as you can. And if you can literally have like, what are you gonna say? And run through that in your head when you finally hit that, what are you gonna say? Maybe, you know, maybe it's um, a conversation you have with your partner or you're calling up your best friend and you're telling her, oh my God, like da 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 da. Like, I don't know, whatever it is, just pick a scenario that you, you visualize every, and you wanna stick to that visualization so make sure it's something that's really genuinely makes you emotional and it is quite difficult guys this isn't easy it's taken me quite a while to really understand how to do this and to actually emotionally connect with my with what I'm manifesting and and the visualization that I'm I've got like it took me a while to to connect with it emotionally and you know maybe the first time you do this you don't necessarily have an emotional connection but you're just piecing together the room and what the app like what the room's going to look like and maybe the next time you picture the same room and it still feels good so you're like okay this is definitely where it's going to happen maybe and then you're starting to go through what you're wearing what are you going to be wearing that day like is it going to be this or do am i going to know like maybe if for example i've just hit a thousand subscribers maybe it could be like i'm about to film my thank you like 1000 subscriber video what am I gonna wear am I gonna like how am I gonna have my makeup how am I gonna have my hair picture all these things and it might change for a while but you want to find it where it's consistent where you connect with it where you have like an emotional attachment to that vision and then you'll just it will just click where it you'll get the emotional feeling with it like you'll and it will feel like you're actually there and it's actually happened and that is what you want that feeling right there is what you want and and then you just need to give yourself a minute to really embrace that whole visualization. And that is, and it will just put you in the mindset of the person that you need to be for that to happen. Because we're not chasing dreams. We're not chasing, like manifestation is not chasing. It is becoming what you want in your life because like attracts like. So you need to vibrate on the same level of what it is you're trying to attract in life. So you need to continuously get your mindset and your head into that position into that space so that you understand what it is that you need to do daily because you need to be on the same vibration. I really hope that this has helped somebody understand the power of visualization, how you can do it, and the emotion that you really need to connect with it. Please do let me know down below if this has helped. I'd really, really love to know that. I know that there are gonna be people out there, however, that this isn't going to help because physically visualizing something um, can be really difficult. So uh, maybe it's connecting with the emotion more and you don't physically have like the whole atmosphere, what you're wearing, what you're doing, all this, but maybe it's more like, what are you gonna say? Like, what are you gonna do? How's that gonna make you feel? Like, what are you gonna do the next day when you find out that thing, you know? Um, you just want the feeling is the most powerful part of it. And that's what you really, really want to connect with and like gravitate towards that feeling because the feeling is what gets your mind into motivation mode and like, this is on, I could do this. This is what I need to do. Like I can see it, I can feel it, it's coming. The universe is going to give that to me when I just I just need to work on myself and becoming, becoming that person. We're not chasing, we are attracting, we are growing, we are becoming because like attracts like. When you become the person that you need to be to get that thing that you're trying to manifest, it will come to you because you've done the work and you've, you're now deserving of it. The universe always gives you things that you're deserving. So when you are working hard and you're doing your thing, 
growing and you're you're constantly developing personally the universe will always match that energy so yes i hope this video has honestly helped somebody i'm really really um just loving these kinds of videos i hope you guys are too and i will see you in the next one thanks again guys bye